Aquarius. What up, though? Welcome to Swimming Through the Void. This will be a general reading for the sign of Aquarius. Wherever that resonates at for you, keep in mind you can flip the roles or flip any of this if you need to, if it comes to that. Also, don't try to make the story fit. Take what resonates, leave the rest for someone else. Tapping in y'all energy. This got deep really quick, so I decided just to hit record. You guys say a prayer real quick and hit record, I should say. Um, a lot of like past past life past childhood uh memories a lot of healing taking place right now a lot of contemplation a lot of realizations so let's jump right into this tarot and see what we have we're going to check out the past present and future see what you have coming your way and then grab some advice and we'll grab a couple oracle cards as well mother father divine holy spirit of the most high messages for my aquarians for their highest good to help empower them healing for sure to help them step into their most highest vibrational divine timeline to help bring them clarity to help empower them if i said that already what do we have here in the recent past for my aquarians there's definitely a lot of energy coming through okay whoa 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 So much, I don't even know how to, there's a lot going on, a lot of change, a lot of shifts taking place. It seems like some bullshit going on behind the scenes here with some type of boss, father figure here. I see, okay, wow. Hmm. So maybe light being shined through your meditations or through your dreams on some things that are going on here. Aquarius, I see a lot of conflict going going on here, but I have also, wow, some betrayal too. This is like wild energy here, you guys. A lot going on here right now. The ending to a, a cycle for sure. We have a major ending here. There's a message about making sure you're taking care of yourself here, Aquarius. I do see a victory. I see you coming out on top. I see a success here. I see you being recognized for your hard work. I see you having a lot of protection, your angels, your guides, your 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 spirit peoples literally with you right now. I'm also hearing that God is with you, Aquarius. Wild. Like whatever is going on with this shady com uh, very chaotic I would say toxic betrayal energy here I feel like the universe is sort of shining light for you and bringing balance bringing justice bringing you a victory bringing an ending to this stuff wow you guys not sure how many people this is going to resonate with this is pretty wild what do we have incoming for my aqua please spirit this is a deeper, deeper spiritual thing right here. A healing within your connections or something like that. Aquarius, there's a message coming through when you're with the magician saying that you are in a position of co-creating right now. So make sure, yeah, look with the eight of pentacles, a lot of growth, a lot of learning, a lot of realizations. This feels like a huge level up for you, Aquarius, like a spiritual level up definitely keeping your thoughts as positive as you can right now you guys i see like a lot a lot a lot going on a lot coming at you a lot of energy in this reading you guys and this is super scattered and all over the place i feel like this is too a lot going on on the astral realm you guys and so making sure you are staying protected right now tap in with my spiritual protection video i will link it wherever that link pops up at you guys but look eight of pentacles here this is about taking classes workshops learning like uh mastering your craft so whatever it is whether you're learning magic whether you're learning how to sew whether you're you're leveling up here you're taking classes or maybe watching youtube videos or whatever on how to perfect your craft here 
or on how to for some of you this is consciousness and stuff that you're learning more about and like some spiritual spirituality tapping into your psychic abilities here okay you guys i see there being uh i'm hearing diamond in the rough here so whatever you're going through right now aquarius as chaotic as this is coming through as i feel as if this is very spiritual in nature and i also feel as if you are sort of leveling up okay so i see there being a portal here i see the i'm gonna grab you some advice but with the fool here it's like trust your intuition trust what you're learning as well aquarius um definitely trust your intuition though like trust what's resonating with you right now what we have is advice this the wheel so something about change here wow there's a rebirth happening aquarius this is For some of you, this is like some type of past life situation that's happening right now. And you're sort of aligning to the next chapter. Advice. This is really about making a change, Aquarius, and standing up for yourself. Standing up for what you believe in. Fighting for what is right. Speaking your truth. Stepping into your truth really discovering your truth as well i'm hearing and i see you eight of cups walking away from a lot of bs some of this for some of you it's going to resonate different for everybody right but you guys are walking away from whatever doesn't serve you anymore if this is family members old friends acquaintances co-workers um situations um, this could resonate differently for everybody, but what is happening is you are leaving behind the things that are no longer serving you. I think you're really seeing the truth, uh, on things and look at, there we go with that wisdom, this wisdom being gained and with the hermit being number nine, you guys, this is the, the ending of that cycle. Also sevens coming through for you very heavily. It feels like your divine masculine and your divine feminine energies are sort of balancing out you're really leveling up on a spiritual level here is what this feels like aquarius one more card of advice that eight of cups though you guys queen of cups following your intuition into this new journey into this new energy into this this is new this is the beginning of the fool's journey here you guys this is the first card of the tarot it's the sacred clown in this deck which is um called the Hayoka. actually you guys let's read this card from the Starman Tarot. And this is the Sacred Clown. First card of the Tarot. A major arcana. So major things popping right now. Let's see. The Sacred Clown or Hayoka from the Lakota tradition knows that nothing we think is actually true. No belief is fixed. As trickster and shaman converge, he probes beneath the veil of normality to reveal the astonishing and unexpected let's see indeed the gap between you and what you have understood to be you his words are like light a lightning bolt which can pierce the heart this card depicts the sacred clown dressed in black and white strip at black dressed in a black and white striped antler hat whoop hope you guys can see that um grinning mischievously as bursts of flame shoot from his fingers naked and painted to the waist he is surrounded by walls of garish graffiti which appears to be alive morphing moving strands of hypnotic color bursting with energy standing on a path beckoned with sharp toothed traps of ill-gotten gold he appears unconcerned that they might cause him injury an almighty star ball of molten fire glows and puckers close behind and he is indifferent he is touched by everything and damaged by nothing seeing the cosmic cosmic joke the ultimate illusion where we see limitation fear and pain at at once both innocent and dangerous his fire pokes holes in the things you take too seriously he puts a pin into the puffed up balloon of your story the triumphs and the woes of the past the projected fears of the future because he understands the primordial energy of nature is beyond good and evil beyond human ideas of right and wrong joy and pain are united two sides of the same coin 
for me, no other character so epitomized Bowie as the Hayoka, the the wise, innocent, the sacred clown. He is an absolute master at piercing reality to expose the absurd. He was never f afraid to experiment and discard the design of brief when something perverse and unexpected caught our attention. The enlightened player of the game of life. The challenger of convention. He gave me full permission to risk dancing at the creative edge. Let's see. Starman Tarot, twisting things around and turning them in their head. Christ the sacred clown. Christ the sacred clown mocked orthodoxy. Buddha the sacred clown mocked ego attachment. While Gandhi mocked money and power. He invites you to risk to risk big, that you must risk the sting and bite of life to experience its true wonder. Sorry, you guys. <laughs> the sacred clown invites you to live in the exciting potential and freedom of each moment. The Hayoka provokes, prods, and startles you out of the hypnotic dance of a monkey mind. He bids you be aware that you are not the stream of fear and desire endlessly surfacing, but rather the expansive freedom in which these issues appear and disappear. When you say I, you are referring to your story. Your story is not true. The burdens you have carried for so long can be put down because they never belonged to you. Something new awaits you on unexplored paths, so step into life fearlessly. Renew, refresh, and rebirth yourself. You are a child, innocent and free. And you guys, you did. You got this childhood. You got this healing. You got this path that says it all. There's so much going on for you right now, Aquarius, energetically. This is some uh, deep healing here. This is beautiful energy. I want to grab you guys uh, one more oracle card here before we tap out if anybody wants to book a personal with me holler at me my information is always down in the description box below you guys and protect yourself spiritually like i said there is a million and one ways to do that prayer uh, meditation seeing yourself surrounded by the white light like i said i'm going to link that video at some point in this video of my spiritual protection if in case anybody is interested in that um, but going to be very important for you guys right now with all of this crazy energy going on. What do we have for my Aquarian spirit? <clears throat> In unusually challenging situations, the ways we have supported ourselves during more ordinary times are insufficient. We need to be open to divine inspiration, protection, and proceeding in new ways. Here is a portent of unexpected success, even if everything appears to be going against you. The tide shall turn through divine grace. And then Kamala Devi, held within Kali's protection, your heart radiates peace, certainty, and beauty. Her grace melts frustration into inspiration, fatigue into replenishment, and overactivity into effortless attraction. Kamala is the golden pathway of divine protection and peaceful contentment. She empowers your heart to receive with the same generosity, openness, and grace that you express when you give. You are swiftly approaching sacred fruition. strength you guys are super protected right now your guides your angels are literally you got a force field around you so fear not be still and know be still and know hope love and acceptance you guys divine alchemy move beyond current challenges focus on what it is you desire so my beautiful aquarians i hope that message helped in some way if it did hit that thumbs up share this if you feel so inclined uh, make sure to subscribe and hit that bell if you haven't already so you get notifications on my future readings take a deep breath with me you guys and be sure to be breathing consciously you guys deep cleansing breaths as many times as you can throughout the day stop and take a couple conscious breaths okay and then tap in with me in a few weeks and let me know how that's going for you because something as simple as that will truly transform you in ways that i can't really explain you guys i'm not the most articulate so let's take a breath together and clear this energy before we tap out hold it 
and release. You guys, I hope you have a blessed rest of your day and I hope to see y'all again soon.